I mean, just tags, not too much going on past that. I think that other player prone is outside the building, so not too much to worry about for the Sonics. An aggressive front here from Citizen. Now they're going to try and flood in via construction. Two big pickups, Direwolves fight back. Sonics thought that they had the cleanup on the Rome game, but simply did not have enough in the tank. Stuns out now. It's a 1v3 for Grixer. Plenty of time for him, plenty of talent as well at his disposal. He'll pick up one. He starts us off. Sonics with quite literally zero respect for the defensive setup that Direwolves had on this round. As they try to quite literally brute force their way through, even mollies that were sitting on the ground there as well, incendiaries that have been blowing up. As Grixer now tries to oh. the remaining 1v2. That's a very long range. Oh, effort. big fight here for Jackie Wu. Silence. Nobody wanting to make a move. <laughs> That's from the Sonics have to trigger it here. They don't. Not necessarily. Oh! oh, man. Citizen with the patience of a saint waits for Jackie Wu to reposition. And for Jackie Wu, it's just so unfortunate. Ray will be able to make up the oh! difference and then some as he pushes forward, knocks out Geo, and got the trade on a Citizen. Rex it alone here in the 1v2. 10 seconds to play, and he's already been clipped off of half of his HP. That shot came in from down below. Absolutely decked him. No real intel to play off of here. Ray once again just wrapping his way into a win. A triple kill on the round for him as the Direwolves hold on. Nothing he can really land on, but he can break up some of this soft breach. One of the, rid of one of the Kiba barriers. Another nade could go decently deep here, but he's going to get on the uh, clone. It's going to be a push in now. Rex with a fake out. Rexon with two big kills here from Laundry. He'll find the man advantage as well. Citizen finds one on the other end. It's down to Racy in construction. Nice kill onto Citizen, but where's this plant coming? They don't have the case right now. They have to try and find Racy. An aggressive front. He's going to back into the corner. Pushes back in towards elbow, but nobody's home. Rexon's got the case. He's going to start the plant. Racy has a smoke. He can break things up over towards the freezer side. It's a plant in tight right. He'll get one. Has the opportunity! And Racy keeps the dire wolves alive! Racy just refuses to give up. He's bringing round after round of incredible play. Single soul in the area. Every person is upstairs or off in small tower for dire wolves. They've practically given the keys of the castle over to the Sonics. This is looking like Oregon might be in their hands. The plant down. Difficulty increases tremendously, but Jackie Wu, much like his teammate Ray C on the previous rounds, and not giving up here. Still going for the fight. Souffle in for this one as well. Jackie Wu already halfway through the counter defuse, but his teammate now dead. They need to push it though. He's stuck it out right, and they can't take him down. The nade's too slow. They sneak out a counter defuse and continue to hold on. We're going to round 12 to settle this one. Probably a good time for attack timeout. Let's listen in here and see what's going on. Timing Rexon still mid flash toss there, reeling from it. Gets caught out, peeking, gets away with one. Gunnar finally trading out the first kill of this round for the Sonics. Harambe also being down there, so maybe we're not done just yet either. As the Sonics now have access to the site, but will they actually be able to take it here? Still being at a disadvantage on a 2v3. Scariest thing about this entire situation is that Citizen has plenty of timing plays available to him that aren't available to a single other person in the entire game, all because he's Nook. Uh, audio going to be extremely useful, especially with that pickup. They have so much time at their disposal, John. They can get it done right here. It's gonna be a big pick. Oh, Cunner, gonna have to slip in behind the fridge. They know he's here. Prone angle for one of the players. Citizen's gonna rotate back up the stairs, and this is what I considered at that time Looks like it's going to be a fake here. He's going to get Gunner out. I absolutely love this from Citizen. So very smart. Using this help presence sensor to its maximum potential. See if they can potentially get some pressure on that far side. Citizen's going to let this build back up and let Gunner start to deconstruct everything on this far side here. Big pickup from him. Now they just need to move in. He might be able to just solve it here. Who needs a puzzle when you have a fist? It should be the plant. Big plays here. Plant might be coming in here from Gunner. Nice shots. Gunner has to stick this. He's able to clean it up. He has to push through. All the comms coming out. Shotgun in hand. Oh, it's so very close on the HP. Back and forth. They go! Racy! He doesn't fully commit with this team. And I mean, this is just the beginning, John. This is their first tournament ever together. Such an exciting story that we have at our hands. Absolutely the case. So it's still time to see Direwolves grow in the future, of course. We are going to have to say goodbye to them for now, and hopefully we'll see them.